I'm Antonio Centeno, the founder of Real Men Real Style. Today, I'm going to be answering the question, should you wear a bow tie to an interview? All right, if you haven't already, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. By doing that, these videos will come right to you. In addition, if you like this, if you find it useful, I would appreciate it if you would like it down below and make sure to grab our free 47-page ebook on men's style. And if you want more, if you want something even more awesome than the free ebook, I've got a premium ebook which has over 600 pages, 400 pictures, 14 hours of audio. It's pretty awesome. It's got some other bonuses and stuff included. That one's not free, but it does support my business here in Wisconsin. I consider, I would appreciate it if you check it out. Okay, this is the question that came in. Herman is asking, Antonio, what's your feeling on wearing a bow tie on a job interview? I'm an African-American male who dresses sharp on and off the job. There is this stereotype though, that if I wear a bow tie, I'm classified, or I think I'm classified, with the nation of Islam, or how about this, I'm an attorney. Bow ties are the most elegant piece of clothing I can think of. I love them. Ever since I've learned to tie them on, I wear them all the time. I don't even think I even own any long ties anymore. But however, lately, I'm worried that I'm not getting hired as I go into interviews because of my bow tie. Am I overthinking this? All right, so Herman's going into interviews. He's wearing a bow tie. He's probably going to be one of the only guys in. He looks around. He's the only one wearing the bow tie. He's beginning to wonder, am I not getting hired because I'm wearing the bow tie? My quick answer to this, possibly yes. But let me explain. So people can choose not to hire you for millions of reasons. Who knows? There probably, I mean, depending on how many interviews you go to, there probably has been a hiring manager, a non-professional one, who didn't hire you because of the bow tie. However, that was a very, you know, I quali wanted to qualify that because the real question is, is your bow tie hurting you, Herman, as you're going in and applying to multiple job interviews at professional companies? My answer here is no. And the reason I'm saying this is, number one, look at the economy. I, I think you're trying to possibly put blame on something because you're a bit frustrated that you're not getting hired. And it is tough out there. I have many friends who are out of work and I know how many interviews they've gone to, how many resumes they sent out and gotten nothing back. And so, you know, it is, number one, the economy. Number two, is any professional hiring manager has been trained to look past appearances. So it doesn't matter if you're sporting a pocket square or a bow tie. They are really, they're, they're working to take this into account. Now they can't 100%, you know, nullify all the effects of a well-dressed gentleman who comes in versus someone who is really sloppy and you're not going to get a job just because you're the best dressed. Well, Maybe, I don't know, maybe if you're, you're applying for a, a job as a model, perhaps you would. But the point I'm making is that you're going in to multiple, uh, and meeting with multiple people for multiple interviews. I, I can't see this having an effect time and time and time again. And, uh, I, you know, so, so the question is, you know, what is causing the effect? Why are you not getting hired? You know, Herman, I am not a career coach, so I can't give you that answer. But I can tell you that you're probably wondering, should I continue to wear the bow tie to interviews? My answer is going to be yes, because you feel confident and it sounds like it's become a part of who you are and your personal style. And do you want to work for a company that has a policy of not hiring people who wear bow ties? I don't know about you, but that would be, a, I, I don't think I'd want to work for a company that, that would have that policy. And, and really, it's about your confidence wearing it. It's perfectly appropriate. It is going to help you stand out, but is that a bad thing? And I really don't feel that you going and interviewing, and if anyone has to disagree with me, go ahead and put it in the comments. I'd especially like to hear from other hiring, hiring managers, but... Uh, I'm going to post this video in my LinkedIn group as well. In the LinkedIn group, we've talked about this and I've heard from numerous hiring managers who have said, and we've actually talked about this with pocket squares, that it has no influence. They look at your qualifications and they want to hire the best 
qualified person who is going to fill that position and help their company do well. So at the end of the day, that's what you know they're going to be looking at. And uh, Herman, I hope you continue to wear the bow tie. I wish you the best of luck. And if you've got a question out there, you know, dealing with men's style, make sure to go to our website, menstyleqna.com. Again, menstyleqna.com. That's uh, better than those YouTube comments down below where I can't even keep track of all the comments. And if you go to menstyleqna.com, you can leave your question. Uh, the best questions and answers are rising to the top, and I'm going to make videos from those. All right. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.